now you just have to repeat after me. Okay. But first, I'm going to talk to you a bit about marriage. Well, we're gathered here today to witness the moral journey of Tyra and Bob in the legal state of matrimony. You are to be married according to the orders, the customs, and the authority granted by the government of the province of Upper Bay. Now, matrimony, as understood by us, is a state that is enriched by a long and It is a commitment for life, therefore not to be entered into thoughtlessly or irresponsibly. So, there must be a desire for lifelong companionship. Couples will support and comfort each other through the changing experiences of life. You will laugh together in your joy and your grief together in sorrow, but you'll grow together in your love. Marriage means caring as much about the welfare. together to maintain a home in which the marriage may flourish. So with this understanding now, I pray and enjoy. Wish to be joined in the good marriage. Okay. <laughs> Solemnly declare May not be joined in matrimony to Tyler George Robert Quinn. Way too many names for the marriage commissioner. <laughs> we only have a one, so we have lots of names. <laughs> George Robert Quinn. Why I, Tyler George Robert Quinn. May not be joined in matrimony. May not be joined in matrimony. To lovely joy, very So, no impediment is declared or ignorance or required in your answers to these questions. So do you, Tyler. You must give to this is over. Just look at each other. Tyler, you're going to go first. Here we go. I call upon those persons present. I call upon those persons present. To witness that I, Tyler. To witness that I, Tyler. Do take you lovely. Do take you lovely. To be my lawful wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. In whatever circumstances. In whatever circumstances. Or experiences. Or experiences. Life may hold for us. Life may hold for us. Have we done? Okay, darling, here we go. I call upon those persons present. I call upon those persons present. gently here. We're going to keep the circle of love going. All right, there's the ring which could be our till today. Here we go. <clears throat> Look at her. 
and say these words. <laughs> Lovely, I give you this ring. Lovely, I give you this ring. That you may wear it. That you may wear it. As a lasting reminder. As a lasting reminder. Of our marriage vows. Of our marriage vows. And as a symbol. And as a symbol. Of my love. Of my love. And commitment to you. And commitment to you. Go ahead, darling. Here you go. Okay, lovely. Do you say I accept this ring? I accept this ring. left hand back in yours there put that ring on okay now just turn his hand over there's his left hand there you go here's his ring sweetheart okay put it on the tip of his finger and say after me father i give you this ring father i give you this ring that you may wear it that you may wear it as a lasting reminder as a lasting reminder of our marriage vows. of our marriage vows and as a symbol and as a symbol of my love of my love and commitment to and you commitment to you go ahead darling tyler please say i accept this ring i accept this ring as a symbol as a symbol of your love and commitment of your love and commitment all right all hands together put your hands all in here together here you go well You have consented in marriage. You have declared your solemn intention in this company before your witnesses and in my presence. You have exchanged these rings as a pledge of your love to each other and you have joined your hands right now to accept one another. So now by the authority vested in me by the providence of Alberta, it gives me the greatest honor to pronounce you husband. <laughs> and applause. Everybody? There we go. Thank you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Quinn. <laughs> Now you have a lovely queen.